I think Dr. Fairbairn <laughs> might join you. Um, and then faces no, Dr. No. and Ben. Okay. No, actually, I'm going to be too busy. You're going to be too busy to. All right, David, so you're on your own. Oh, this. Great for some balls out. Yeah. I'll sing, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll try and sing with you, but I might be doing other things at the same time. Either. So, all right. Wait, all right. So, are we? Hang on a sec. Yeah. Wait, stop watching over here. Thank you, everybody, yes. Yes. for coming. Thank you. So, um, we have a nine minute limit with a one minute buffer. So, <laughs> at, at, if they're still up there after 10 minutes, the, door, the floor will open up and they'll drop down to the There's end. There's a shark tank <laughs> underneath. Yeah. All right, Sam, you are on. All right, so um, first thing I just want everyone to do is I want you to mark your scores. So um, we'll look at the top system that starts obviously with measure one. The second system is seven. And tell me if I'm going too fast or if you need it repeated. The third system is 10. Then the top of page 56 is 13. The next system down is 17. Next one down is 21. Then page 57 is 25, 29, and 32. Page 58, it starts off on 36, then 40, then 44. Then page 59 is 48 and 52. And then we're in the Benedict. So, all that you're going to be learning is from pages 55 to 59, and um, I will be teaching you guys just the first page, the adagio of this particular movement. So, we talked a little bit beforehand about this being the Lord Nelson Mass, and um, we briefly went into a little bit of the history. So, now let, I, I would like you to follow through in your scores, and... Um, just listen, watch your part, and listen, and try and hear your part while you're going through. We're just gonna listen to the first minute and a half. seven um, and I I will be subdividing the beat um, in my conducting or trying my best to and um, so uh, what I want to do is I want you guys just to sing the notes um, we're only going to be working on rhythms and pitches we're not going to be adding the text at all today um, so let's start with measures one through seven and we'll start with sopranos and altos on one and two and three and four and um, it'll be going a lot slower though, so. <laughs> Not to song, to, but, um, all right. So, so sopranos and altos. All right.
Now let's do tenors and basses, and then we'll all do it together. Okay? And sopranos and altos, feel free to hum uh, while the tenors and basses are going through their part. Okay? Ready? One. and then we'll add the notes, okay? So what I want you all to look at um, is this wonderful little example right here. So can I have you clap this? And then we'll say one and two and T, E, and a four and, okay? So let's all just clap it, ready? One, two, one. Nice job. That was pretty cool, right? So how does this relate to our music? Um, take a look in measure, measure 7, beat 3. What can you tell me about that? Has a 16th note. Very good. So what we did is we took 8th eight notes, which is the 1 and 2 and T and 4 and and we subdivided it even further to three and a four. So what that does is that makes us feel that dotted eighth note through the sixteenth and then on to the rest of the eighth note. Eighth note, sorry. So let's just be sure to keep that in mind too. Um, notice anything else odd rhythmically about um, these few measures right here. The alto line's different. Alto line's different, okay. On what beat? And where? Seven. And of four. And of four. Second measure. Oh, Second eight. measure. Eight. Okay. That's one one spot. Yep. Yeah. So altos, be sure to re remember that part there. Um, otherwise, you know, there's a couple parts where the tenors decide to have a couple eight notes, um, or the tenor in this case. Uh, so let's start right now. Uh, let's just go um, with the rhythm. Um, we will do the rhythm on ta and tap the subdivision. Okay, so we'll just do ta, 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 that kind of thing, okay? So we'll start with um, sopranos and basses first, okay? <clears throat> Ready? One and two and three and ta. Ta, ta, ta. So sopranos, uh, your rhythm on measure nine. Ta, 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 ta. Okay. 
So you hold it while everyone else moves, okay? All right, now let's try tenors and altos, and um, then we'll move on to the notes, okay? Two minutes. Two minutes? All right. All right, so let's do the, let's do the rhythm. Um, let's have sopranos, basses join us, and tenors and altos will do our rhythm too, okay? So uh, let's go, all right. One and two and T and ta. Ta, ta, ta. Add the notes to that, okay? So if we can have the sopranos and I, we have the pitches too. S A P B. Oh, everybody. Everybody. Let's just do everybody. Uh, Confident enough to do the last two measures all together? Feel good enough about it? All right, Sorry. let's try it from the beginning. Okay, from the beginning. From the beginning. Yeah. Ready? System, measure 40, 40, 41, 42, and look for 43 where you're going to be coming in. And I'm going to play at 41 just so you can hear what is leading up to this. And 41 is 1, 2, T, 1. going to be coming in on two in measure 40, 44, or 43, I'm sorry. So if we can look at measure 43, basses and tenors. Bass is your pitch is here. And tenors, you are here.
try that again, my fault, sorry. If we can go for measure 43. I'm gonna go a little slower. I started out too fast, so. One and two and three. Oh, no, I'm sorry, we're gonna have you go on pa. So pa, pa, pa. So one, two, T, one.
try that one more time. And we'll go from 43 again. So, oh, the one measure leading into that. So, one, two, T, one. Oh, oh, oh.
quarter, um, measure 19.